some conventional methods like this. Okay, so this is why we use for uh, person non person or human non human detection and also for many other computer vision tasks. So this is, uh, these are some examples of detecting faces and then recognizing as well. Okay, so so far we have seen some of the uh, conventional uh, computer vision aspects. So what I will do subsequently now is to bring in uh, some of the deep learning, uh, uh, machine learning friends. Okay, let me see if I can play this. Okay, fine, that's okay. So essentially these are all, uh, this is referred to as visual tracking, where we want to track the objects of interest. So say usually object of interest, whichever we have, we characterize by some features again, and that features we want to see from image to image, or frame to frame, that is referred to as tracking. Okay, so no. for all these things, now I will, uh, all these, many of the computer vision tasks can be posed as a classification problem. What do we mean by classification? Say if I want to detect a face, I take a patch and say whether the face in that patch, is that patch a face or not a face. Okay? If I want to track, for example, what do I say? In the object of interest, okay, is it okay, is it same object of interest or not? That means if I 